Hey y'all, welcome back to Let's Play DK64. This time we are going to fight the boss of Frantic Factory. Um, now, here I think is what people tend to consider the hardest boss in the game. But, I don't think this boss is as hard as it is annoying, per se. Like, I've never had a, like, except when I was, like, a wee baby person, which I, I talk about that a lot when I'm playing this game, when this Let's Play, where I've spoken about that, like, 20 times. But except when I was, like, a wee baby person, this boss never, only seems to just get on my nerves a little bit. Um, switching out to Tiny, because she's the one you fight the boss with. Cool, so Tiny Kong is who we're fighting the boss with, of course. And welcome to How about the most unique kind of entrance? This pad is lit up, let's stand on it. Oh boy. This right here is Mad Jack. Um, so yes, Mad Jack, because of the way he's fought, is genuinely considered the hardest boss in the game. What you want to do is just keep spinning from place to place. Okay, he's on a white pad. So you're going to see uh, a few of these. And what you want to do is not get hit by his attacks. Because if you do, you're going to fall to the ground. And you have to start the process over again. And I think you can see why this boss is considered genuinely annoying. <laughs> Um, so trivia, this is what I was going to talk about. Mad Bat, Mad Jack is technically, in the game's coding, the only boss you are required to beat besides the final boss. And I will discuss this in a... I'll give you, I'll show the reason off in a bit. Hopefully, anyway. Okay, I want to head over to the next one. This is where we want to go. Hit the switch. Hit the switch. Got it. The problem is Mad Jack doesn't go down in five hits, three hits like the other bosses do. Mad Jack, I think, takes more like... Um, Mad Jack, I think, takes more like... So white. I'm trying to find out where his is. It's I fell off. My advice is kind of stick around the center. Of course, you know, Mad Jack, he gets kind of... You know, this is really the first boss where you kind of have, like, uh... You know, the boss, like, kind of strange strategies, like, halfway through the fight. Got it. Let's hit two. Again. 
people do consider magic. Like I said, he's not hard. This is basically just enduring, waiting for him to pop out, and then stunning him. That's basically it. That's the strategy you want to go for. Of course, though, like I said, I said Mad Jack, and I'll show you this. I think next time he comes out is when he does. Like, he, he's already going faster. That's another thing you're probably going to notice right now. He's going much faster. I think now also is... Oh, freaking you serious? This way. Again, I'm going to say keep it to the center. gotta be one of these two. Of course, it's me falling off the cliff. Keep going in circles until he pops his ugly head out. Blue. So again, it's got to be one of these two that I can't see. It's this one. Got it. Hit three. Mad Jack takes five hits to beat. And now he goes much faster. And now he gets even more annoying. Um... But I, I still don't think Mad Jack's difficult. I just, I would say annoying and difficult are two different things, for sure. Oh shit. Got it. Don't know if I took damage there, I don't care. Now he's gonna turn invisible. But that also means you're almost done with him. You can still see him, but... I don't know why they did that. I mean, he is a man. But, I guess it just kind of makes, like, where he's firing and stuff, but it doesn't really make the fight any worse. The fight already sucks. A lot. Which one plays He's out. Go. Got him. That's it. Phew. That's Mad Jack for you. Phew. And that takes care of our final... Our next boss. Next up we got, uh... I say we go ahead and exit the level for now. That's all we need to do here. And I'm going to take care of some stuff in the lobby now. Pretty sure we can do a bunch more stuff here now. Like, uh... Mm. Something's in here for sure. I'm going to go ahead and destroy this thing. We got Tiny's Dude Thinger, and you got a Banana Fairy. Nice. So yeah, there are four or five of these things on DK's Isle, too. Where's the banana? Very. Yeah, 
honest. Gotcha. The beauty is when we go back to Angry Aztec and all that shit, I'm gonna be able to get all these. Okay, well, that's that for that, so one more thing I want to do in here, yeah? Switch over to Donkey. We can now grab this. And then we got those drums up there. Nice. I think I can get the next banana with Donkey Kong in the DK Tiles. Yep, that does exactly what I thought. And it also drops off the cliff for some reason. There's some ammo over there, but I don't need that. Cool. Um, next up. Um, I'm gonna head to, uh... Head over to the, uh area where Snide's HQ is located because I can get a, there's a bonus game there with Diddy Kong because he had a pad there and stuff and also there was a boulder there covering a covering one of the arenas one of the crown arenas which will actually give us enough crowns to actually beat the game. <laughs> of course I'm going to go for all of them because that's my job as the let's player is to go for all of everything that gets me 101% Completion. All right, so we're gonna go here. So we're gonna go with Diddy Kong first, though, because I feel probably what I want to do first. I remember this one being the slot machine game. Yeah, yep, it was. It is the Baddy Barrel Band, Baddy Barrel Bandit. And I gotta get this time three again. So after the grape, you got the banana. After the watermelon, you got the banana. After the coconut, you got the banana. After the pineapple, you got the banana. 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 Messed up. Banana. Just uh, restart. Oh yeah, you can pause the game and restart. Trivia. This one's a bit quicker. Banana. 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 Or not. Banana, 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 banana. One more, I can do it. Banana, banana, banana. Bad luck, oh my god, I would have not made it anyway. Gotcha, okay, there we go, I finished it. This game sucks. Never doing it again. Next up, we're going to switch over to Chunky Kong. Where's the... There's the switch barrel. Switch over to Chunky Kong real quick. And I'm just... Yeah, you may not have noticed. I just, I just had so many failed attempts at that. Oh my god, it, I, it took me much longer than it took me to be bad. Mad Jack on that. No joke. Um, did that not give me any... I thought sometime... I, mean, I thought maybe it would have been Anakin's out of that. Anyway, I'm going to do this as well. This will be our last uh, crown as well. Ooh, boy. Well, not the last one we have to do, but... It's the last one required, anyway. It's the last required thing, and I think... Hell, oh, those are enemies we're not even supposed to see until, like, way later in the game. It was, like, skeleton dudes. 
We're not supposed to be in the game until we're not supposed to see him until like way later. But I don't care. We're going after. We're gonna go after them because we can do it right now. If we can do it right now. We should as well do it now. I do it later when you can do it now. Or is it now I do it now when you can do it later? Oh, okay. Don't procrastinate is the message of the story? Okay, next step. Um, we're done with DK's Isle for now. I mean, with, uh, yeah, we're done with K. Rule's Island for now. Nothing else we can do here, I don't think. Except World 4, but we're not gonna do that yet. We're not going there yet, no. That's dumb. I think, actually, for there's something around ch the island for Chunky. And I think there's a lot of stuff we can do on the island with Chunky right now, now that I think about it. We got... Three bananas with Donkey. We've got, uh... I think on this side of the island there might be... Yeah, that's it. I need that. I can do this right now. Thought so. Cool. I'm right. It's like, wait, no, there's no... I was like, is that a... No, it's not a banana. It's, not, it's, it's a bee. That's the first banana we got with Chunky on this island. And it's definitely not the last. Um, oh yeah, right here's where the number three is. Um... And that might seem a bit out of place, but it's there for reasons that you won't see till much later. I'm gonna head in here real quick. Um, and we got a saxophone. So we're gonna grab a Linky Kong. Not a text, one that's a, a trumpet, sorry. Yes. Gold banana and a donk donk donkey clone. Yeah. Alright, cool. Now we've got a Now we've got uh, almost everything we can. So next up, we're gonna head up to the uh, cliffy area with Chunky Kong. Because there's still some stuff we can do up there with him as well. If we can do it, we're gonna do it. Let's head down on aisle to number two. In here we got a saxophone, and in here we got a triangle. Let's go ahead and play that. So we can do that. Let's go ahead and play that. Which gives us another banana. And next up, we're gonna play as a. I'm gonna switch over to a uh, Lanky Kong again. So we can play the trumpet again. And I can't get that yet, but it's gonna get me to another. Yeah, that gets me two bonus mini games I can do with Don Diddy Kong later. But that's activated. We can't go there until soon or later, and that's fine. That's something I can't even do now, so we're not worried about it too much. So we're switch over to Tiny Kong real quick, and one thing I want to do is uh, activate this. No, like that. I meant. Go in here 
And then, of course, we can actually finally do that one bonus game as well. We play as Tiny Kong. I'm going to switch to Chunky Kong now. Go over here. Now you go kill the bees. And there it is. I need this. Activate something. And that just gives you a uh, chunky's uh, missing barrel. Which, that's practically useless. Um, because you don't. I don't even use those things because I know where everything is. But they do give good hints, I'm not gonna deny that. But, like, I'm pretty sure we've already got everything we can right now. So we switched to Tiny Kong now. I like how he's like, Chunky Kong, by the way, is all like, Yeah, choose me, guys. Please, choose me. And then the second you put your curse over him, he's like, No! I picked Tiny Kong instead. Oh, yeah, one other thing I want to point out is Donkey Kong is, uh... I missed. This one can be a pain in the arse to get. Yeah, I missed again. I'll get it this time. Missed again, okay. I gotta probably jump a little bit higher before I can even reach it. Okay, let's try this here. One more try. Missed, Jesus Christ, is there no collision detection on that thing? One more try, I'm gonna go off screen. Once I get in the barrel, you'll see, you'll see. I can't even see at this point. Missed! What the fuck? It's dumb. That is really dumb. This thing doesn't work. Bad collision detection, I swear. There is no way I should be missing that much. Maybe I can just let's try standing in the middle, why not? Let's see what happens if I stand exactly in the middle of this. Nope! I, I, I swear I'm hitting the barrel too, so I shouldn't be going straight through it, but I am. For some reason the game isn't picking up that I'm actually hitting the barrel. I hate that so much sometimes. Got it. Thank you. Bug bash, big bug bash. I think I remember how to play this game. I played it already. I don't know if there's anything I haven't played yet. I think I've played some of them. I think I've played a lot of them at this point. Not all of them, but most of the games. Luckily, this one's just keep pressing the A button until you freaking hit the bug, which has never been an issue at all for me. This one's pretty easy. They died. I win. Anything else I am missing on DK's Island right now? If I am, I'll get it once I'm done with uh, the backtracking of everything else. So let's head actually out. Now all of DK's Isle is done. I'm gonna head over to uh to the uh, final. Head back to World One, I say. Next time on Let's Play DK64, we will finish up 
World 1. I will see you guys then.